So guys, I got an unboxing here. Got a package. Gonna open it. I know what it is, but I'm really stoked to see what it is. It's a knife. I'm really stoked to handle it. I've never handled this knife before. And it's gonna be a piece of craftsmanship and I'm I'm just excited. So let's just get into it. Let's cut this son of a bitch open. Alright. That's awesome. Is this a sticker, I guess? It's a weird sticker, but I take it. Well, this is cool, but like it's a weird type of sticker. I don't know how that works, but all right. Oh my God, here it is. D Rocket Designs. <laughs> Comes in this sick case. Well, it's just like a plastic case. It's not that sick, but plastic case. The fuck? The foam. This is beautiful. Like, so beautiful. D Rocket Designs. I forgot the exact design name of this knife, like the model name, but it's an OTF. Single action OTF. And I'm afraid to open it. I'm not afraid, I'm just really excited. So, this is the safety. Pull the safety down, then you press the button, and it fires. But, alright, I guess we should get ready to open it for the first time. So, you pull the switch down, the safety, and the safety's off, and then you press the button, and it should fire. Oh, my finger was in the way of, the, of this thing, but it still came out all the way, so. But let's, let's do that again, let's reload it. Do you press the button? Yep, you press the button to reload it. Then you just... Oh. Okay. M390. Steel. The blade shape is pretty cool. I like that there's like a slot in it. And then there's like a little ring. The handle scales are <clears throat> anodized titanium. Pocket clip is titanium. Button is titanium. I mean, the switch is titanium. I think the button is steel. I'm not really sure, but the button is really easy to push. It's a good button. Got the cool little rocket on there. Like, I really like these designs. I've been wanting to get one of these knives from D-Rocket Designs for a while. I see their posts on Instagram, and they have a lot of cool knives that are pretty expensive, but I got a good deal on this. <clears throat> Alright, let's just, let's check out that action again. It's not as powerful as I was expecting, to be honest, but it, it like, I feel like it does the job, so you... Yeah. That's pretty chill, I mean. And I'll see the power block in the place the blade is. There is a little bit of blade play, which, you know, is expected for all OTF knives. Unless it's a pentagon or a deadlock, you know, but probably just as much as Microtech. But, like, I can't push the blade in, so. <clears throat> so, yeah, the blade seems pretty sturdy as far as OTFs go. And, um, it's really easy to recharge. 
the hardware is just Torx head screws. I don't know if I mentioned that. But yeah, you'll definitely see a further review on this. Still have to get kind of used to it, but... Feels good in the hand. It looks really cool. It's got a good weight to it. Premium materials, man, like titanium and M390. I feel like even Microtech, I don't think they use titanium. They use like aluminum, SOG, use the aluminum on their Pentagon. Though I do think Deadlock uses titanium. I mean, that is a thousand dollar knife, so. This I got for like 150, I think they were, but I think they're going to bump the price to like 300. They have other models with like an orange G10. It was pretty cool. There was another model with, it was black. And there was one that was like, um, titanium with the dang I can't think of what it's called but the button is a little like st sticky but after use it will get polished up and a little smoother same with the action probably put a little bit of oil in there I like how that this is opened up so you can like see inside of it there you can see inside of it there and, yeah, you can clean it probably without taking it apart, which is pretty cool. I'm excited to carry this and use it. The edge. Looks a little thick behind the edge, but... Not too bad. <clears throat> Alright. Like and subscribe if you want to see a review for this. Because I'm going to be putting one out. In like the next month or so. Or maybe a week. Not a week. A couple weeks. I could see that pretty pretty easily. See if we can get some paper. Sticky note. It's just like a piece of paper. Let's see. Nice. Okay, that's pretty sharp. It could be sharper, but. Factory edge is pretty good for saying how thick it is behind the edge. Let's see, does it shave? Yeah, actually, damn. It shaves really well. <clears throat> I mean, it is M390, so it will take a good edge. Now, I'm sure they added some oil to this knife in the factory before they sent it out to me. But I'm going to add a little bit more and I'm going to maybe clean it out a little bit. No, I'm not going to take it apart or anything, but as you can see in there, the, the spring. See, these Q-tips can't even fit in there, but it looks pretty clean. There's no like lint or anything in there. Mainly I was going to use this to get inside the blade here because it's like this slot in the blade is like a track where there's a, I don't know if you can see it, but yeah, there's like the lock, locking mechanism goes through here underneath the button, I believe. I mean, I'm not really sure. I haven't taken it apart, but 
All right. Just add a little of this ballistol to this Q-tip. Some on the blade too, because it's never a bad idea. See, look, what is that black stuff that's coming off? This is brand new, I'm not really sure. Maybe it's like metal, ground metal, that's hopefully not, that would not be a good sign, but I guess that's why we, what was that? I feel like, yeah, the First time I fired it, it was pretty weak, but the more I fire it, I feel like it's getting more polished and stronger. I don't know, sometimes when it fires, it's not super strong. But most of the times, it's pretty strong. Like, every time it's strong enough to, to fully come out and lock into place, so that's good. And yeah, I'm excited to use it and carry it. It's a super sick design. Like, I'm honestly really excited to have this and have to have gotten such a good deal on it. Titanium OTF knife. It's my first single action OTF knife. All my other OTFs are double action, so it's kind of cool. It's like a novelty. All right. Alright, that's it for this video. Have a good one. See ya.